Jameson. She's a Nashville-based designer who creates custom bridal gowns and apparel with her business, Rudy Lou. And she's making a name for herself by transforming something old into something new. My name is Sarah Jameson, and I have a bridal brand called Rudy Lou, where I make custom wedding dresses and accessories and also recreate vintage wedding gowns into new age pieces. I went to college for fashion design. When I graduated, I started doing alterations at a corporate bridal store. When I was 23, I decided to take the leap and go out on my own to start making custom wedding dresses. I knew that this is something I could handle. My grandfather had a company that did embroidery and manufacturing. His machines that he used then happened to be the machines that I use for my business now. My mom later came into the business and took over the embroidery aspects. She still does all of the embroidery for my business. It really is a full circle moment, a full family affair. When you come to me, all of my designs are custom, so nothing will ever be replicated. For my brides, I try to always make it a timeless look that will never go out of style. Being a very sentimental and detailed person, I love looking at my brides on their wedding day and knowing that my bride feels her absolute best. Please welcome Sarah Jamison to the show. first bridal designer. Yay! I'm so happy. I mean, this is, this, this is truly in your blood. You mentioned your grandfather yes. had an embroidery business growing up. So this was really the fabric, if you will, of your life. Yes, absolutely. I started this at a young age. I have always loved the fashion industry. Going to college, I didn't really love the academic side. So once <laughs> I, well, so once I found my niche in fashion, it was Game over. How did I you find it. that niche? Because there are so many options. I mean, you yes. could go with any any route, but bridal is so specific because it's in the heart. It's personal. We know say yes to the dress is real. <laughs> yes. So that's tough. Yes. So starting out, I studied fashion design. As soon as I graduated, I got a store or a job at a corporate bridal store where I fell in love with bridal. Oh. I saw a lot of things that the bridal world was missing. I would see. Give me an example. Of what was missing? So multiple girls on the um, stage trying on the same wedding dress. And I just thought that that kind of took the personable side out of it. So that's why you went custom. Yes. So I thought that I could give it something that I hadn't really seen in the bridal world before, being one of one. Wow. I love that. Well, we have some of your beautiful pieces with us today. Let's start off. This first look is a 40-year-old wedding gown that you were tasked with updating. Tell me about this dress. So this gown was originally worn in 1981. It was a client of mine came to me and her mother-in-law had asked her to wear this dress. Wow. She knew that she wanted a strapless gown with an open back. This gown originally had a full collar with full long sleeves. The mesh side pieces that you see right here actually were the sleeves. Oh my God, it's beautiful. Thank you, Skyla. Our next look is Lexi. This is a custom wedding dress that you created for the photographer who helped you launch your brand. The gown is convertible. Come on out. Yes. Oh, wow. Yeah. This looks so regal. Tell me more about this. Thank you. This was a really special gown for me to make. Working with a fellow creative, it was so fun to collaborate. She had a vision of exactly what she wanted. Being a wedding photographer, she really knew what photographed well. So she wanted to have a little bit of a sheen to it, so we did a little bit of the glitter underlay. The embroidery or the design work is just absolutely breathtaking. This gown was a passion project, I will say. It was 12 hours of hand sewing. Oh, that's stunning. Absolutely beautiful. Thank, Thank you. you so much. Now tell me, I get to finally stand up again in this. Yes. This is incredible from top to tail here. Tell me about this dress. So this gown originally had a very high neck, long sleeves, and a full covered back with no slits. So I completely converted the waistline, neckline, wow. 
sleeves and everything. So gave it a new breath of fresh air. Life. Now, you don't just make the gowns. Your tailoring has become what's made you popular. People love your tailoring. Is it Elton John commissioned you? Harry Styles? I was commissioned to make gifts for Elton John and Harry Styles. And it really gave me an opportunity to look outside the bridal world and give my creative juices flowing and really study an artist. And, and now you're in streetwear. Yes. <laughs> oh, wow. Look at that. The farewell. Oh, Yellow Brick Road Tour. Over and over. Rocket Man was on repeat. It's just so I movie. could get inspiration oh, and see kind that, of how. That looks like Elton John. Yes. For sure. Thank you. Well, congratulations. Thank, Thank you. you so much for submitting Thank your you. design to our up and coming designer series. Thank you, Sarah.